just not a real person. I don't know. <laughs> you said either him or Donald Trump. What makes you think it's Donald Trump? I mean, it seems like some illiterate nonsense that would come out of his mouth. <laughs> I'm guessing you're not a fan. Yeah, no. No, so you will not be voting for him. No. No. Did you know that she's probably going to be the new? Yeah, I have yeah, heard. Yeah, you're going to vote for her? We'll see. If she is the person, would you, would you consider voting for her? I mean, possibly. Possibly. Yeah. Because she doesn't say, like, illiter illiterate things like that. Like, not like that. Yeah, not like that, certainly. Yeah, certainly. <laughs> certainly not like that. Um, it was her. Oh, <laughs> it was wow. Her. <laughs> oh, no. We said that was What's up, YouTube? Hope you guys are feeling good. Today, guys, we're back again to a new video. Today we're going to be checking out Guessing Who Said Dumb Kamala Harris Quotes. Okay, let's check this video out together. Dollars right now, That's billions right. of dollars. Go ahead and read the quote. Let me make sure my phone didn't go off. Did it go off? You're I good. Love, All right. I love Venn diagrams. I really do. I love Venn diagrams. It's just something about those three circles and the analysis about where the where there is the, the intersection, right? <laughs> Who do you think said that? Who the hell said that? Was it her? No, no. I love. No, we know what she said. Okay, okay, okay. I love Venn diagrams. Who the hell loves Venn diagrams? It can't be these two, cause they don't even speak English for real. I don't think she would say that. I don't think. She why don't? Why not? It just doesn't sound like something she would say. Don't tell me it was her. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm done, I lost. <laughs> nah, this is definitely JoJo Siwa. You think JoJo Siwa? Yeah. Why? Why do you think that? Because this is just like, she's talking about Venn diagrams. Like, it's just three <laughs> circles, comparing stuff. And she's talking about intersection, how it's so fascinating. I'm not sure. <laughs> really sure. <laughs> it's not this girl. I might say one of these two for some reason. Okay. Uh, Why would Elon Musk really love Venn diagrams? Well, he's a smart guy, so I'm sure he likes diagrams, you know? <laughs> okay, who do you think said that one? Biden's not on there. Um... <laughs> Now, I'm gonna say JoJo. You think JoJo said that about Venn diagrams? Possibly. <laughs> She's done a lot of lot of controversial things recently, so. Yeah. Can you give me your best JoJo Siwa impression? Karma, do it. Oh do no, the dance. no, I'm not doing it. <laughs> Karma's a bitch. Can you give me your best JoJo Siwa impression? Uh, that, it's like the deep voice raspy. I'll give you in. It's my ex or whatever it is for her. <laughs> oh, it's you do it. YouTube oh, too? Yeah. Okay, so what's your YouTube? Uh, Florida Bushman. Florida Bushman. <laughs> This is perfect. And he's the Georgia uh, prankster. All right, go ahead and read the quote and tell me what you think it okay. means. You need to get to go and need to be able to get where you need to go to do the work and get home. <laughs> Who do you think said that? Um, I'm going to guess him. For us at every moment in time, and certainly this one, to see the moment in time which we exist in our present and to be able to contextualize it, to understand where we exist in the history and in that moment as it relates not only to put the past but the future. What does it mean? It means a whole lot. I mean, this is definitely, I don't think it's anyone in the top row. Maybe okay. it's like some like Google Translate Zelensky thing. <laughs> definitely not JoJo. Sounds like an Elon Musk thing, I'm not gonna lie. You know, okay. he, he messes with the aliens and he's talking about contextualizing <laughs> the past and history. I gotta go with Elon. It's also Kamala Harris. She just says everything? What's going on? What else do we know about this population? 18-24. They are stupid. That is why we put them in dormitories and they have a resident assistant. They make really bad decisions. This some, this some Elon Musk type quote. You think so? 100%. <laughs> why do you think so? Because, bro, Elon, Elon be crazy. He be wildin' sometimes. They are stupid. That's 100% something he would say. <laughs> Talking about locking them up? Hell yeah. That's <laughs> <laughs> that's um, <laughs> That's some, okay. that's some Elon stuff. All right, final answer? Yes, ma'am. Hey guys, if you like what you're seeing and you like my content, first hit that subscribe button, and two, head over to my Patreon at patreon.com slash Caitlin Bennett. For $5 a month, you can support my work. Sometimes I need bodyguards because things get crazy, and I always am going to need babysitters these days. So $5 a month can get you access to my private Facebook group where I will chat with you one-on-one. -on -one. What else do we know about this population? 18 to 24, they're stupid. That is why we put them in dormitories and they have a residence assistance and make really bad decisions. Who do you think said that? I don't know. Um, what, it's like a famous quote? So if someone on this board said that. Who do you think said it? Is this guessing? Trump. 
You think Trump said it? Why do you think Trump said it? Because he's stupid and sounds like a stupid quote. <laughs> you think Trump is stupid? We don't think yeah. <laughs> okay, what if I told you if it's not Donald Trump, who would be your second guess? Um, Elon Musk. Elon Musk. Do you think he's stupid too? Nope. No. But you think he says something like that? It's Kamala Harris. So I don't know. I don't, oh, yeah. I don't follow Kamala Harris. It's tough. Yeah. yeah. Well, you're not voting for Donald Trump. Oh, that's what I thought. I'm not was. voting for... I'm, I'm actually not voting for any of them. Okay. If you could vote for anybody on this board, who would you pick? Um, I'd vote for Elon Musk. Who do you think said that? Hmm. Probably Elon. Probably Elon. A lot of people are saying that. I don't know. Why do you think it's Elon? Because it sounds like a really smart thing to say. And, you know, he's got a really big brain. And, you know, he's, he's just talking about the younger generation and how stupid and all that. Possibly. Because, you know, he's up there and we're, we're nothing like that. All right, who do you think? To her. <laughs> you think she said that? No. Oh, you're just saying. I think it's Donald Trump. You think he called 18 to 24 year olds stupid? Yes. Yeah. Why do you think that? It's just so on brand. Yeah. Yeah. It's, that must be some of that Gen Z talk. Trump 2024, but I feel like that's like on brand. <laughs> it was actually Kamala Harris who said that. <gasps> well, I'm not surprised either. Every election cycle we talk about this, the most election of our lifetime. So what does it mean? I have no clue. I really don't. I have to say Zelensky. All right. Why do you think that? The wording is just like something he would say. Yeah. Do you think he's like dumb or something? No. <laughs> Sound, it sounds really good. That's what I'm saying. Oh, it sounds really good. Read it one more time. Every election cycle we talk about this is the most election of our lifetime. Sounds like it came from Google Translate. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, it was Kamala Harris. Oh. Is she that dumb? <laughs> she might be. Do you think? According to the quote, yes. Yeah. I don't know, this, this quote doesn't make sense to me. I'm about to say, I don't know, Putin. You think Putin said that? <laughs> you, think, you think he said that out of all the people on this board? <laughs> and you were reading Trump. it. You think Trump said Trump. it? Trump. Trump. Okay. Why? Why do you think Trump? Trump? I don't know, some, something Trump would say. None of you chose Kamala Harris. Is that because you wouldn't think the vice president would say something so silly? <gasps> Not, oh, not the Venn diagram. They all sound like they came from Google Translate, that's why. So it has to be a foreigner. It has to be a foreigner. <laughs> yeah. We were all doing a tour of the library here and talking about the significance of the passage of time, right? The significance of the passage of time, so when you think about it, there is a great significance to the passage of time. It's Kamala Harris. <laughs> <laughs> it is, yeah, yeah, yeah. How did you figure it was her? She always repeats the... Ah, let me be nice. She always repeats herself with just ignorance. Let's go with Trump. You think Trump said it? Elon. Y'all think Elon? So they are stupid as you know about the population? Well, why would you say Trump? So from the dormitories and residences, they make really bad. You know what? I'm going to go with Elon. I see him on Twitter all the time, tweeting about the stuff. So yeah, let's go with Elon Musk. Elon Musk? Yeah. Okay. All right. What if I told you it was Kamala Harris? Really? I stand correct. It was Kamala Harris that said that. Okay. Yeah, yeah. What do you think about that? Uh, she just called you stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, hey, it is what it is. It's definitely not Putin. <laughs> Who is this? That is. Talk to a girl. <laughs> oh, bro, what the? F <laughs> uh, I'm thinking either Donald Trump or uh, Kamala Harris. Okay. I, I don't That's know who that I'm is. That's probably bad. Elon. Elon. I think it's prime minister of Ukraine. I guess I, I could just is that Ukraine's Elon. president? I could or, be completely wrong, don't quote me on that. I'm gonna say Donald Trump. Donald Trump? I'm gonna say Elon Musk. The right answer is Kamala Harris. How did you know that? Huh? How did you know that? I mean, that's. I would assume that's like the. Well, I know you guys. Oh. So. <laughs> so you have a little cheat sheet here. Well, You're a little cheating. Like yeah. The agenda. What's my agenda? More uh, libertarian, right leaning. Yeah. Not we got, that she isn't we got an agenda here. <laughs> we were all doing a tour of the library here and talking about the significance of the passage of the right of time right. The significance of the passage of time. So when you think about it, there is a great significance to passage of time. There is such great significance to the passage of time when you think of a day in the life of our children. 
Definitely not one of those. Okay. I don't think. It's like him, her. Okay. Am I right for one of that? Yeah. All right, now we're, yep, yep, it was her again. <laughs> we invested an additional 12 billion into community banks because we know community banks are in the community and understand the needs and desires of that community as well as the talent and capacity of community. Kamala Harris. <laughs> Puppets. <laughs> yep. How'd you know that so Look quickly? Because she just says the same words over and over again and doesn't make any sense. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead and read that quote. Every election cycle we talk about, this is the most election of our lifetime. Uh. What does that mean? I do not know. <laughs> that doesn't sound like proper grammar. <laughs> yeah, that so is I'm not. I'm assuming so. either Elon or Trump. Yeah. Think, a lot of people have been saying Elon Musk today. Okay, so why would do you think it would be Elon? It seems um, like something he would tweet out. He's just not a real person. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you said either him or Donald Trump. What makes you think it's Donald Trump? I mean, it seems like some illiterate nonsense that would come out of his mouth. <laughs> I'm guessing you're not a fan. Yeah, no. No, so you will not be voting for him. No. No. Did you know that she's probably going to be the new? Yeah, I have yeah, heard. Yeah, you're going to vote for her? We'll see. If she is the person, would you, would you consider voting for her? I mean, possibly. Possibly. Yeah. Because she doesn't say, like, illiter illiterate things like that. Like... Not like that. Yeah, not like that, certainly. Yeah, certainly, certainly not like that. Um, it was her. Oh, <laughs> it was wow. Her. <laughs> oh, no. We said it that was Elon Musk. <laughs> so now we're going to tag him and let you guys know what he think, what you think about him. No, I'm just kidding. Maybe we will. We'll see what happens. But yeah, it was Kamala Harris. Uh, yeah, so, I mean, I'm sure that doesn't sway your vote or anything, but uh, yeah, she's a little goofy. Do you think she's goofy? Uh, yeah, she's a little goofy. A little goofy. I like Absolutely. her. I love her. Right. If you could choose anyone on this board to be the president and vote for, who would you vote for? <gasps> oh my gosh. Anyone. Wait, anyone? Yeah. Ooh. The hot tool girl. Yeah. 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 Why would you choose her? She's just the best choice. She's one with the people. She's a people's princess. Like People's princess. Mm -hmm. okay. I love her. It's funny thing about Kamala Harris is that she's so much repeat her words like over and over again. She says something, then she said again, I am the president that I went to travel. I'm the... She's so much repeat her words, Kamala Harris. Like, it's something literally everyone knows now. Like, if you watch her video, you, you notice the rambling and repetition of the words. Um, I don't know why they think so little of Donald Trump. I don't know. I feel like are, there's so much belief to that man. Lot of it. I feel like he's stupid. I don't know why people see him like that. Well, Donald Trump is really a smart man and someone who has American interests at heart. You see, every one of them who this lady interviewed right here, uh, I see how they were picking Donald Trump and what they say about him. They think so little of him. Like, uh, it baffles me. Like, I see that the first four years he, he became the president and he could make impact. He was a peacemaker. People still did not see him or see his significant impact in america the borders were shut not completely shut but it was limited illegal Im immigrants were not entering into the country and america was not as terrible as it is right now so that people don't see his impact at all i don't know how people think so little of donald trump that he will see some stupid dumb ass shit um there were some people who were able to like spot it out at first that it was kamala harris because I've watched a couple of Kamala Harris um, clips and I noticed she, the repetition of the words. I'd be like, what is this woman I'm trying to say? And some of her quotes, they're kind of like crazy. You'd be like, am I getting it wrong? Should I read it again? Let's see. Um, this interview was actually beautiful. I, now I'm able to see people's perspective and how people think about Donald Trump. And also Kamala Harris. Uh, I watched, I love the entire video. I love this lady. Liberty Hangar, you guys should go subscribe to our channel because it's really incredible. Her videos are actually focusing on the right wing and um, she's a Republican, <laughs> if you ask me. And I'm glad. I, I love checking out her video of recent. I just figure, out, figure her out and I love checking out her video. Um, she's really incredible. Comment down below to about this video. Give us a thumbs up, share this video as many as you can. Subscribe to our channel. I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure you stay safe.